Hey guys, it's Green DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting to reading to episodes 15 and 16 of Dr. Stone's. Let's go ahead and get started. Episode 15 in 3, 2, 1. figures yeah yeah your soda's coming Mm-hmm. Yeah, because you want to be with him too, right? Can we just talk about the dad in the background? <laughs> But uh, you sure? You, like, I I thought you always had feelings for Chrome. <laughs> yeah, I know, cause she can't be honest. Oh my god. <laughs> Cause he's like, I got a chance. Well, he's out. Yay! Yeah, because I don't think the whole village will Can, can we wait until he wakes up? Oh my god. It's so good.
I mean, is is there any other way? <laughs> is there any other way? <laughs> we can't just wake him up. Don't make me choke on my drink. Unfortunately. We don't have time, though. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> uh oh. Yeah, please make my girl some damn glasses, please. <gasps> my thing is, why didn't you do that initially when he, you know, collapsed? Got knocked out. Then boom, y'all could have had the match, but no.
He would be asleep. Ah, yeah, to make the soda. The fact is that he would literally just check to see what it is and instantly run. We're like, Ayo, you're finally making my soda. <laughs> Damn! Are you guys okay? Well, yeah. <laughs> you need more like a um like a dripper. Well, what, not what I was thinking, but okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's crazy. So does she need to take it with water? Yeah, don't cry. You'll be fine. There's a cola. <laughs> I'm not trying that, but okay. Now, if you make some Sprite, I'm your girl. Yes. Behold, Tylenol! <laughs> Oh. 
Is she really? Hold up. Like that? I mean, she could have did it herself, but okay. I'm just going to keep my comment about that to myself. Yes. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Y'all ain't gonna give me no water. It's freaking dry. No! Mm -mm. I'm good, I'm good. Not after that one TikTok of the girl who did eat rats, and then she got, like, hives or something. Nah, bruh, no. But even before, I would never do that. Mm -mm. Well, you know, thank God it's not COVID. How would I know? Listen to him, how do you? Because <laughs> if they didn't, they wouldn't be doing this. <laughs> Grandpa, oh my god. <laughs> Grandpa would be like, yeah, I kind of do. Mm. <laughs> Shut up. Thank goodness. You just gotta trust the process. Oh.
Now go apologize. <laughs> My girl was like, yes, I can stand. I can run. I'm out of here. Why you do that? Why did you do that? I, I, I mean, I know because time-wise where we are, we're at 21 going on 22 minutes, but why would you end right there? I'm happy she's okay. I'm happy she's, she's healthy. She's thriving. Baby is out here running. She she thinks she can just do anything now. And, and you know, I, I'm happy for her. Like, thank God. Like, she's she's cured. Everything's fine again. You know, Sanku's now freaking chief of this damn village and ish. But. No, okay. Here, here's my thing. <laughs> he, he got married and divorced within, like, minutes of each other. Which is fucking hilarious. Because, I mean... I, I think that is officially the shortest wedding I have ever seen in an anime before. I mean... <laughs> I, I mean, like, I've seen some short weddings and marriages, but... <laughs> Cake. Like, oh my god, I even know. You, you end, like, right where he, she finally says his full freaking name. I don't even know what else to say. It was a damn good episode, though. I was not expecting all that to go way down. You wouldn't think that, you know, once he gave her the drug, that she would just, like, it... I, I mean, I know instantly it's gonna take time because, of course, when you're thinking about, like, anything when you're having an illness or whatever disease that you have when you are sick, you're not instantly cured by that first freaking pill. It, of course, it's gonna take a while. But thank goodness that, you know, he was able to figure out what it was, what else he needed to do to instantly cure her and be like, okay, she can finally, you know come out of hiding and such or just you know being shielded by you know her dad and everyone else in the village because of course yes she is the most important person in this show as of now um <laughs> i'm happy for jen <laughs> jen <laughs> baby finally got some soda i, I mean yeah like he's in some more too maybe that's it i i learned something new today like it, it makes me now want to go on YouTube, probably after this, or probably, yeah, probably while this is editing, before I probably go back and retry the boss challenge for Stellar Blade again for the demo, um, just to watch a random video <laughs> of how Coca-Cola is made, because, like, as a kid growing up, um, I used to watch the Food Network a lot, like, when I was bored. And such. And that could be mainly, like, during the summertime, I was really bored. Like, anytime when I was in the house, I, when I when I was not watching, like, regular behind cartoons, I was watching Food Network. And that was, like, my bread and butter of learning new things and such. And maybe I did watch a video on the Food Network or a show on the Food Network on how soda is made. But it is been a long behind time. <laughs> that, yeah. Yeah. Okay, go ahead and pause the video and I'll see you guys in one second for episode 16. <laughs> Alright, episode 16 in 3, 2, 1, go.
Right? I, I mean, we need more context, please, sir. Yeah, like, that's the biggest question. I'm just going to let it play out. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Oh, that's why you said that. Oh.
That could be your calling. <laughs> Holy shit, damn, bro. Well, so your legs won't cramp up when you go swimming. Please don't tell me something bad's gonna happen. I don't want if that's gonna happen, I'm gonna be so freaking pissed. Dad. Damn. Now we also gonna see what the fuck happened to his dad, cause I'm guessing his dad is dead, right? He's probably going to see when... Is that Rui and Kohaku's mom?
Because that clearly looks like the dad. No. Damn. Oh my god. <laughs> Not the Starbucks. <laughs> You don't want to talk to your families? I mean, you never know. Something could be happening soon.
No, oh, damn. It, it, seriously, that's all you want? I mean, damn, you're in space. No. So No, he see Oh I had a fucking feeling that somebody was going to witness that But the thing is, we, we know it's going to also affect them as well. Because, oh, my God. Plus, there's no power. Nothing. What is that going to do? Y'all are the only people alive right now. A year? They're all fucking stone. No one's coming.
Bro, you can't. Oh my fucking. You <laughs> Okay. Oh, this is... Mm, why did I have a weird feeling about this episode? We got halfway through it. And we once it said five years later, and the fact that Seki is a teenager, and I'm like thinking, yeah, you look like you're around the same age. Where everything went to ish. And the fact is that they're the last six months. How are you going to get down to earth? And because his dad didn't turn into stone, yeah, eventually his dad died. They all, all six of them died. I don't even know what to, what to even say right now. I'm, okay, no, let, let's do it like this. Number one, I'm glad we finally got that context because like that was the biggest thing I wanted to know. The fact is that his dad was the one who set up the village. That's fucking nuts. And just like, and then we're gonna see everything up until his final last breath for all six of them and such. But the fact that, like, the mom was there to everyone. What the fuck? crazy in this only episode 16 how the hell is this show gonna go i mean i only have like 17 18 19. shit no do it again 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 eight more episodes before i'm done girl this one this, this is something i i mean this is a cliffhanger of all cliffhangers but it's like I, we're going to see essentially like how he can save everybody, including his own son. But my thing was, cause I was like, yeah, I was like, we haven't really, we've seen his dad, but not as much and such, but to get almost like a whole one to one episode, literally with his dad for as much as they could. And then focus more on his father to see the day the earth, where everybody got turned into the sta into statues and they're the only six people alive. Mind you, five years later, within a week. Cause I'm like, yeah, like it, it's been, it's only been like, what, a good couple of days since y'all have all been on this space station together. So, and, and there's no way in hell, all, like at least all six of them have to go down. There's no way that, two or three of them decide to stay back because if they do then they're dead this some ish right now oh my god this shit is nuts what the fuck oh my god i i am flabbergasted about this but i am very intriguing and excited to see how this is going to go but Oh my god, that's all I gotta say about this. Other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episodes 15 and 16 of Dr. Stone. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel and make videos every single day. Show the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for episodes 17 and 18. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.